I have a whole collection of Goyard. 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 The Goyard, this Goyard as well. I really like just Goyard in general. When it comes to the world's most coveted high-end brands, names like Louis Vuitton, Gucci, and Hermes quickly come to mind. But there's another label most discerning luxury aficionados speak of in the highest regard, Goyard. In the ever-changing world of luxury fashion, Goyard continues to stand out as the ultimate status symbol for the world's wealthiest. Goyard back with a honey, yeah. And I know why you mad. Beloved by aristocrats, celebrities, and fashion icons, high-profile personalities such as Meghan Markle, Pharrell Williams, and Victoria Beckham have all been photographed with their Goyard bag in tow. Renowned for its exceptionally crafted bags, trunks, and custom travel accessories, the Parisian Maison is the ultimate definition of exclusive luxury. You also can't buy Goyard pieces just anywhere. It's all part of the label's mystery and reclusive branding, which makes Goyard products that much more appealing to consumers. Today, buying a Goyard piece is the ultimate investment purchase for many. The brand is the epitome of sophistication and prestige, with designs meant to simply be timeless. Behind the Hype Goyard. Goyard by the trunk, uh, Isabel Moran. Popular in the streetwear and hip-hop community, some noteworthy moments for the brand include ASAP Rocky sporting his messenger bag at the 2016 Grammy Awards, and Kanye West starting the Goyard briefcase trend when his infamous 2009 Paris Fashion Week photograph alongside Don C and Virgil Abloh went viral. Pablo Picasso, Coco Chanel, and Marilyn Monroe were special clients of the Parisian Maison as well. In fact, the Duke and Duchess of Windsor were also avid collectors and owned several choice pieces which included a customized trunk able to hold 150 pairs of shoes. While hard to believe with all the celebrity cosigns, there's still an air of secrecy and intrigue surrounding Goyard. In a rare brand profile, a Goyard representative told Hypebeast magazine that, luxury is a dream, and revealing too much of what goes on behind the scenes would spoil the magic. Any type of advertising and marketing is practically done by word of mouth and usually only spoken about by those in the know. Goyard also told Hypebeast, we believe that whispering softly in someone's ears is not only more elegant, but also much more efficient than screaming at the top of one's lungs. You won't find Goyard publicly announcing its celebrity customers like other luxury labels today, but they are keen on educating consumers about its rich history and traditions. Goyard is the oldest leather goods and trunk company still in business. It was founded in Paris in 1853. Even then, the company had been doing business dating back to 1792 under the House of Martin, crafting custom travel trunks and providing monogramming services for train travel. It wasn't until 1834 that the store moved to its historic 233 Rue Saint-Honoré address in Paris, where they still remain in operation till this day. Goyard started to see more success in 1885 when Edmund Goyard took over the business that year. Edmund increased the house's status amongst the elite by attracting international clientele and developing what we know today as the Goyardine canvas, the cotton and linen weave used to make its products. Perhaps the Paris brand's most recognizable calling card is its signature monogram. Specifically, the repeating chevron pattern is actually the third letter Y in Goyard. The letter is formed by piled dots in different shades to create an interlocked three-dimensional effect. In fact, the dots you see up close symbolize the Goyard family's history in the log driving business, which was before they went into the trunk and luggage making trade. The infamous monogram in combination with Goyard's vibrant colors is what creates distinction and desirability amongst its products. While the house's classic tones are black and tan, special hues such as burgundy, blue, orange, and green are also highly sought after. Goyard's luxury designs only has five product categories, ranging from travel goods, handbags, accessories, pet accessories, and special orders. Prices range from $300 to $16,000 US dollars and can go higher depending on custom requests. Goyard once made a special trunk that turned into a writing desk for Sherlock Holmes creator Sir Arthur Conan Doyle. Additionally, requests for hand-painted monogramming are still available and can significantly raise the cost even higher. What's important to note about Goyard is that it's still privately owned to this day, and that means having control when it comes to quality, quantity, and consumer expectations. Luxury retail analyst Pam Danzinger stated, if everyone has their mass market products, it's less desirable. Goyard holds its traditional craft-oriented roots that truly has a limited supply because that's what their commitment is about. Ultimately, Goyard is as authentic as it gets when it comes to the savvy consumer aspiring to own the best possible product money can buy. As the company says, we believe in being authentic, true to ourselves, and the best version of ourselves we can possibly be. We like to think that Goyard is a state of mind, and as such, is for everyone. Behind the